And the president informed uh, Mark Milley, the, the chairman of the Joint Chiefs, I, I would like to send troops into the cities to stop the protests. And uh, Milley resisted and said, I'm not going to do that. That's for law enforcement. We're not going to send soldiers into the cities. And they got into a shouting match, as I'm told. Uh, and uh, they, they sort of fought it out. Uh, they yelled at each other. Uh, somebody described the room as basically two bullies. And uh, the president backed down. And, uh, you know, the meeting went on for a long time. They were in there for several hours. But at the end of the day, uh, they, didn't, they didn't send the troops into the cities. I, you know, what's striking to me is that for all, uh, what I glean from your reporting is as, as sort of scary and, and, and overwrought as the, 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 the response has been, the, the men on the Lincoln Memorial, the, the, the protesters being cleared, that there was a version of this, that this was the tempered version that, that, was, that, was, that came out of Trump's impulses for something far, far worse and darker. Well, I, I think that's pretty clear. I mean, those soldiers that we saw around the Lincoln Memorial and some of the other places, and I think the helicopter overhead as well, those were just those were National Guard helicopters. And those are just, I mean, because it's the District of Columbia, those are under the president's command. Right. But, no, he wanted to put, you know, he wanted to put, as I understand it, he wanted to put United States military troops in American cities across the United States. And, that, and that's what the discussion was about. And that's what Milley pushed back on. Now, what, what's kind of interesting here is that General Milley, as the chairman of the Joint Chiefs, is actually not in command of soldiers. He's no, in, right. you know, he presides over, you know, he presides over the, the, the chiefs of, you know, the Army, the Navy, and the Air Force. Uh, but he doesn't actually command any troops themselves. I'm not sure the president knows that, but uh, but, but basically Milley just said, forget it. Um, you know, we're not, we're not, uh, we're not going there. 